Hey guys, Liquid here, and welcome to the next episode of Let's Answer Some Questions. As always, post questions below, and I shall answer them next week. Let's get started. Gear Knox asks, Batman or Spider-Man? I don't really see why you have to ask that. I would have to say Spider-Man because of my marvelous lust. Eagle Solidus asks, What do you think of MGS4? I personally really, really enjoy MGS4. A lot of people, their biggest complaint is that it has too many cutscenes. If, 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 if the cutscenes are really that distracting, you can skip them. It is possible to skip them. You don't have to watch them. I So, the cutscenes really are not a good excuse, really. And, uh, I personally don't mind them. I personally enjoy the cutscenes. I, I don't really think they ever become too long or anything. I really don't keep mind them. If they if, if they ever did, I would just skip them. So, I think it's a good game. Um, the Salakath asks, how many hours does it take to finish 13? It's not a long game. I don't know how long... I don't really know exactly how long I would say it is. It's... I don't know. Maybe... 10 hours? I, I'm guessing. I don't know. I'm just guessing here. It's not It's not that long of a game, though. Cross Noble asks... Call of Duty or Battlefield? Um... I've never really played much Battlefield, to be honest. Um... I've only, I've only played a little bit of bad of the bad company games um bad company one and two so uh and i played a quite a bit of, of the call of duty series so it calls it say call of duty the demicon asks if you had to kill a video if you had to kill a video game character who who would it be and what video game weapon would you choose to kill kill them with um i would kill I'll use a Buster Sword and kill the G-Man from Half-Life. Why not? Buzz Starkiller 101 asks, Liquid, unfortunately, blah 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 blah. Uh, if you had a time machine, would you go back in time to see a great historical figure, or would you go into the future to see the real New Vegas? Well, if the if you're kind of you're kind of implying that the future is going to be like apocalyptic, so I think I would definitely want to go back in time to a place that was actually somewhat livable than like a big apocalypse. So, if, um. I would guess I would go see a historical figure. Don't really know who though. Um, Rip Off Productions at no Rip Off Productions LLC asks, Liquid, are you aware of the Resident Five Resident Evil Five DLC Lost in Nightmares? It takes place before Resident Evil Five and is a good nostalgia trip, but it is incredibly short. Well, I do now. Maga Pokemon asks, "Where is the best place you went to, and why?" Um, I would probably actually, okay, about last year, I went down to, I went, I went like up into like the um Appalachian Mountains, cause uh, it's not really the reason I went that that was uh that was good because I, I was going to a funeral, and obviously that's not good, but. While there, it was like one, every once in a while we would like stop at like a rest station or whatever, and like basically just driving through, through the mountains, right? And it was like it was basically at like the peak of like the big North American blizzard, and uh, just like driving through the mountains and just looking over the scenery of all the snow and all the wildlife, it was honestly just amazing to be honest. It was it was beautiful, but that's like a play the best place I went to. And, 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 the, and the reason it's the best is because of what actually went on there. I went to SeaWorld once, and that was pretty cool. So, SeaWorld, I guess. Or just basically just um, growing, going through the Appalachians. That was actually very, very beautiful. 
ZombieMan998 asks, Out of all the characters in both Left 4 Dead games, which is your favorite? I don't really have one because when I got, when I got the game, everyone, the people that I play with, they, they had kind of had it before me. So they had kind of like chosen their characters, like their like ideal characters before me. But uh, I guess I would, I would probably say Bill because he seems like the most uh, he seems like the most competent at what he's doing. Like he knows, he, like he, he's a he's a war hero. He knows what the hell's going on. He knows how to use a gun and all. Jean Broman asks, "Who stopped? Who stopped the rain? And what are your thoughts on the transition from Fallout Two to Fallout Three? Um. Well, I hope nobody stopped the rain because I am liquid. I encompass all liquids. So, if if the, if the rain stops, then that means I kind of lost a big part of my power source. So." Hopefully no one, but uh, Fallout 2 to Fallout 3, I actually really like both games, um, I really don't mind the change, to be honest, I think I might actually say I prefer, like, the first person series, um, or the first person style, I, I should say, it's not really a different series, but um, I really don't mind it, I think it's a pretty good change, and uh, really enjoyable. Um, Power one asks... Have you heard of DC Universe Online? I have. I don't really know. I, I know quite a bit about it. I'm not, I don't know if it's out though. Um, if it is, I haven't played it, and I don't really know if I plan to. But it looks interesting. Sunny Productions asks, if you had your own TV show, what would it be about, and why? It would probably be a, probably be a sitcom, with starring me, and um, the people that I generally talk to a lot because we get into some crazy antics at times that we would call sitcom material and we've kind of like just like pondered the thought of the pondered the, pondered the thought of making a sitcom out of our antics um Epona fan asks do you like Resident Evil more than MGS I they're really they're not they're two different of they're two different of games to um, compare to be honest I think do I get like more enjoyment? I don't know which one I would say I would get like more enjoyment out of. Um, I've kind of, I've kind of like, mm, I don't know to be honest. As like a first time experience, I think I would say Metal Gear, like would be like the best. But out of like, just going back and like replaying through, I, I would say that like Resident Evil definitely has like more. Like replayability and all that stuff. Duncan Rolls asks, "Will you ever LP a Nintendo Wii game? If so, what? Not anytime soon because I have no Wii, so and no like capture card or anything. So most likely not, unless I somehow magically got like an emulator that could emulate Wii games or something. But even then, I really have no uh, have have no need to to let's play a Wii game." Jack Spacey asks, uh, okay, not in the last video, but in the video before, you said you would like to do a voiceover. I sent you a, tri a script. I'd like to know how I, how you liked it, and oh, liked it, oh, and would you do the role, oh, and one more thing. If you do, when, when you can get the recording to me, oh, and if you want, you can do, if you want, you don't have to put this your next video if you don't want to please write back I'll, I'll write back because that'll just take too, too long to explain the video Shapiro asks what is your opinion on Vanquish I played the demo it was pretty good um uh eh, but would I get it maybe if I had money or something like that but I don't know it didn't really entice me into it or anything is it was, it's was pretty good you know mechs and all like the whole I did like the sliding mechanic. Like it took a while to get used to, but like eventually you kind of just like you're sliding around and it feels pretty good. But uh, it seems like a, it seems like a good game. I just don't really have any need for it. Hey, Liquid, me again. Oh, Jack Spacey asks, 
Hey, Liquid Me again. In your opinion, who who's cooler, Jason Voorhees, Freddy Krueger, or Michael Myers? Thank you for reading this. Happy Halloween. I would say Michael Myers because I like his um his like the shape, stature. You know what I mean? Like Freddy and Jason are more um kind of like crazy and all. Even though I mean Jason doesn't really do anything like my Michael's more of like a fear of what's not there and Jason and Freddy are more a fear of what's there if that makes sense so uh yeah that's all the questions for this week so uh yeah ask the questions below and I shall answer them next week as always liquid out